the reason I left Pakistan was because I saw these children come in who could have been treated. When I read the literature, 60% of children in the United States at that time in the late 70s and early 80s were being cured of cancer. But in Pakistan, the survival rate was zero. And I felt like I needed to go out of the country to get a different perspective on the management of childhood cancer and come back to Pakistan and you know, provide those resources for the children. So I moved to the United Kingdom. And while I was working there in the hospital doing a pediatric um, internship, I truly learned the value of human life. When you're in a country where children die left, right, and center, because they're brought in late, because the family doesn't have the resources, because diagnosis isn't made, because there isn't any time or place to take care of them, life does not have much value. Life is expendable. But when you move to a country where everything is about making somebody better, about one loss of one child is a huge loss. You learn the value of life and living life well. And that's what I learned in the UK. And it just so happened that I met my husband in London. We got married. He was doing his doctorate here at the University of Pittsburgh. So I moved. And, uh, but my desire to make things better in my own country or other low and middle income countries never really left me. And all I wanted was to gain the knowledge and education. And while I learned all that in the United Kingdom and in the United States, I wanted to give back. And that's what I've done for the remainder of my life. 